we stand here. We pray for the work of this place, this hospital. Mm. Uh, we pray particularly for the patients that are in there. We pray for all the care that they're receiving. Mm. Pray for the staff. Pray for those who will visit this day. We ask a blessing upon this hospital. May your name be known and your love shared this day and every day. Amen. Amen. Extremely important, I think, for me anyway, and I, I think it'd be able to agree that it's you know, a crucial part of my life and our lives, probably. Um, and can't get enough prayer really in everyday life and in our town and community. And uh, I know with other people, just take as many opportunities as possible to to lift everything to God in prayer. Um, so it is important, and it works. Because we've seen lots of examples and heard lots of examples of prayer work. Uh, I would say prayer is, is the lifeblood of a Christian and of the church. If, we, if we're not praying, then it uh, takes away the emphasis on, on some of the other things that we do. And through our prayers, it's actually giving us that encouragement and that boldness to be, our, to be the witnesses in the local community. And so our first calling really is to prayer, um, and then everything should flow from that. I think in Alton at the moment, um, we see prayer fundamentally at work in, in how our local churches are beginning to work together a lot more. So in this Thy Kingdom Come, it's been an ecumenical um, initiative for us, and we're doing so many more things together, and being able to pray together in our different churches um, is, is actually bringing us to life in a, in a way that we weren't expecting. So I think for me, that would be one of the, one of the answers to our prayers at the moment. And so let us do just that. Take that time to pray for the things of this town and our community. Pray that thy kingdom will come.